Hello, everybody. Um, thank you for taking the time to join our webinar on your Hografer article in context on the Science Open Discovery platform. My name's Robert Dimbleby. I'm Publishing Manager at Hografer Publishing. Um, before we get to the main part of the, uh, of the webinar, a couple of quick housekeeping points. Um, the webinar is going to be recorded, but without any personal data. Um, we're going to post it later on the Hografer website, so you can just click through and, and, and view it there. You're all on mute, um, so bear in mind that we will not be able to hear you. Um, if you do have any comments um, or questions, please use the question box on the right-hand side of your screen. We'll be checking for your questions as we go along, and there'll also be an opportunity at the end of the webinar to answer them. Hi, I am Agnes Kühlechner from the e-business development department at Hograve. This webinar is intended to take no longer than 25 minutes and there will be, at, as Robert mentioned, time at the end for questions as well. So with nearly 60 million articles and records, the discovery platform Science Open um, basically places uh, Hograve author's publications in a broad research framework, basically uses technology to en enhance the discoverability of your research. Um, Science Open is being supported by Hillgrafer and is and always will be free of charge for researchers. Features such as linked references and statistics about online citation, odd metric scores, user numbers, user ratings and shares provide contextual information to the scientific community. You can also add lay summaries and images to improve discoverability. For the main part of this webinar, I'm now going to hand over to you, Stephanie Dawson, and she will show you more how you can promote your article with Science Open. Thank you very much for joining us. Uh, my name is Stephanie Dawson and I'm the CEO of Science Open. It is really exciting to be working together with Hografe publishers on this project, and I appreciate the opportunity to share some of Science Open's features with you as Hografe author, so that you can get the most visibility for your work. I would like to talk today about what Science Open and Hografe are doing together to promote your publications, then what you can do yourself to reach out to readers, and finally describe some of the advanced features on the platform. As Robert and Agnes mentioned, Science Open is a freely accessible discovery platform with a range of search filters to make your literature search more effective and interactive features for networking and community building. Experts searching in their own field of expertise usually have a set of strategies for, the, for effective content discovery. But a study showed that 80% of researchers search outside of their major, major field at least once a month for grant proposals, teaching, and writing. And that is where Science Open comes in. Thousands of people from all over the world search in nearly 60 million article records on Science Open every day. The filters that we offer, such as uh, open access or show me only preprints, and the sorting mechanisms, such as sort by citation number, by altmetric score, by date or usage, make us an attractive alternative to platforms like Google or Semantic Scholar that are free, but only offer a sort by what they deem is relevant. And other databases with more features like Scopus or Web of Science, which are, um, but which are only available to library users. Within this search environment, we highlight Hografe content in a number of ways. At the top of the facets menu on the left, a kind of shortcut to different filter options, we show collections that contain um, some numbers of articles from the search results with broad content collections like whole grave of medicine or whole grave of psychology. This, these articles will often be displayed prominently and will invite exploration of the full whole grave of collection. Hografe Publishers has currently added over 14,000 articles to Science Open. Too many to scroll through, but with this wide range of filters for quick and easy discoverability, you may find interesting related content from within their full spectrum of journals. This system also lets top articles shine regardless of the volume or issue they were published in, as you can sort by altmetric scores, citation numbers, or newest publications. 
Hograve and Science Open have promoted this co cooperation on a range of channels, including blog posts, Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn. We encourage you to follow both the Hograve and Science Open in these networks or in the network of your choice uh, for updates on our activities. For example, Science Open regularly picks out new articles that catch our fancy and promotes them on Twitter to our over 14,000 followers, maybe one of yours. Uh, to see if we've been actively promoting your article, you can check your Altmetric score via the Science Open platform. More on Altmetric in a moment. Um, if you see the green logo on the Twitter tab, that's us working to help make your work more visible to the wild, widest possible audience. But we are only part of the story. What can you do to further promote your research on Science Open and beyond? The first most basic thing that you can and actually really must do as an author is to share your newly published article with your network of peers. Traditionally, researchers used conferences and sent author copies by post. Now, most researchers use Twitter and Facebook or scholarly networks to get out the news about a new publication. It can be as simple as just putting the title and link to your article on Twitter. Here are a few examples. Our new paper is out now. This can put your work in a wider context and get the attention of science bloggers, journalists, or uh, other uh, multipliers. Science Open makes that easy with the one-click share button to share your article via Twitter, Facebook, or email. Uh, this feature requires no registration, takes just a moment, and can have a real impact. The next level of, of engagement is the option on Science Open to enhance the metadata around your article. You can add an author summary in layman terms along with a catchy image to get attention. This will help you to reach a broader audience, can encourage more community feedback, and increases the discoverability within the Science Open platform by providing more text and concepts for our search engine. So your article will show up more often as a similar article, for example. We also like to regularly promote articles on the site with author summaries. So how do you do it? First, register on Science Open and connect to your ORCID ID or create an ORCID profile. ORCID is a nonprofit organization supported by universities and research institutes, publishers, funders, and other stakeholders as a central identifier of author, um, of author names and publication lists. Once you have an ORCID, you can add all of your publications and take it with you everywhere. To avoid profile fatigue, Science Open only adds and displays information from your ORCID. When you publish a new article, you can update your Science Open profile with one click. And if you claim authorship of an article via Science Open, we will add that information back to your ORCID. So we have really a two-way street going um, to make it as easy as possible for you. Once your list of publications has been added to Science Open, you can navigate to your profile and open an article. Now you will see a toolbar of features to enhance the visibility of your article. From this toolbar, you can add an author summary or image, enhance keywords, or modify the discipline of your article. All of the online activity that is tracked around your publication feeds into your Altmetric score. In the articles published in Hografe Journals and beyond, you can sort by Altmetric score to get a sense of how your work stacks up in terms of online mentions. Of course, this does not say really anything about the quality or impact of your work, and certainly some topics lend themselves more to an online conversation. But it may say something about the visibility of your work, and there are things that you can easily do, such as sharing with your peers online, adding your open access articles as supporting evidence to Wikipedia, or encouraging a mention of your work in a society newsletter or blog. Here's an example from an article published in a Hografe journal that shows the richness of the altmetric information available to you. So it really is tracking news, blogs, Twitter, Facebook, etc. 
On Science Open, you can then track your usage statistics and follow the development of your article views, citations, and altmetric score over time. So now for some advanced features. The Science Open platform offers a wealth of interact interactive options, and I'm just gonna to touch on two here today. First, I would like to show you our collection functionality for community curation. This is an example of a researcher-led collection on Science Open in psychology on thermal imaging in social decision-making. Researchers create these interactive lists as community resources for teaching or outreach. Whenever there's an overlap with another collection on the platform, it is visible at the top of the left-hand menu. Here, for example, there's an article from one of the Hogrefa journals. Here's another great collection on gratitude. So any researchers who are interested in creating a collection on a specific topic are welcome to get in touch and we will help you get started. Just apply today. On Science Open, it is also possible to review an article, very much like a book review. Science Open has an engine to invite potential reviewers, a built-in peer review questionnaire, ORCID integration for reviewers, publication of reviews to Crossref and ORCID, um, and reviews are really um, uh, promoted then widely on the site. Authors are also welcome to, uh, authors can invite reviewers with just a click of a button. We fur have further uh, quick communication options like recommendations and comments um, and also shares. You're welcome to share not only your own article, but other articles that you find on the platform. So if you read an article that is particularly good or impossibly bad, Science Open is really a great place to share your expertise. In summary, I would like to thank all of you for your interest and encourage your participation in this project. It is great to work with a publisher like Hogrefa that is so active in exploring ways to reach the widest possible audience for your work. So I am very happy now to answer any questions you might have. Thank you, Stephanie. Um, one question has come in um, while we've been chatting. Um, somebody would like to have a bit more information about the uh, um, the difference or the relationship between, uh, I think you call them researcher-curated collections and publisher collections. Sure. So researchers um, are uh, who have an editor status can create a collection on their topic of expertise, and they can pull in content from any journals, any publishers that they like. They can add preprints, um, they can add conference posters. So uh, researchers have a, a lot of options in terms of putting that content together on a particular topic. Publishers have been creating these kinds of uh, topical selections for a long time, Usually we call them journals. <laughs> um, so we really wanted to put those two activities, those two curation um, uh, activities in relation to each other. You can always see in both the publisher curated collections, um, oh, how many researchers have used that content in their collections and vice versa. In researcher collections, you can see, oh, here um, is content that shows up in a publisher collection. So we're really trying to create a, uh, a network um, around these, around particular topics that can pull, bring together both um, researchers and publishers. Um, thank you, Stephanie. I think that's all the uh, uh, questions that have come in. Um, I just encourage, like to encourage all the people who've been listening to visit Site Up Science Open and check out our featured collections to learn more about uh, what content is available. Um, thank you again for your, taking your time to learn more about Science Open. <laughs>